What is going on, everybody? The other day we talked about Shibnobi, Shinja making a comeback. Now look, um, Cliff, the Crooked Cliff, is no longer with them. This is nothing to do with them. This is a revival of sorts from the community. It's basically a CTO, community takeover, and they're looking to create a revival because they were passionate not just about you know, anything with Cliff was doing, but but the, the project in itself. Uh, the fact that uh, they liked Shibnobi, they liked Shinja, they liked all of the naming and everything that goes with it. And I'm going to show you a couple of things that have changed just in the last couple of days so that you'll get an idea. Uh, should you be bullish on it? It's my opinion that yes, I think everybody should probably be bullish on it right now because, in fact, the price at this point to me seems kind of like a gift because I get a sense here, I get an idea here that there's some savvy people behind it that might be willing to uh, make some really, really big moves with this project. And if you like this type of content, you know what to do. Make sure you hit the like button and let's kick this off. First of all, let's talk price action. There was uh, a, a big move in the first launch, of course, and then, of course, this is your range for consolidation. And what is it doing? It's bouncing into that range right now. The overall market up here, wrapped Ethereum is at 3,077. It was at 2,900 just the other day when it first spiked up here. So uh, we're getting the, the, the headwinds of a nice little rally by Ethereum as we get the ETFs approved. So I think that everything that's wrapped with, with Ethereum, and this is wrapped with Ethereum on base, is probably going to be a big move. It's going to make a, a uh, just a, a, a really nice, in my opinion, move. So the next piece to it is the website. The, the website's been updated. This is the V1 of the website. You can certainly check this out. Gives you a little bit of an idea of what was going on here. Um, uh, and I'll, I'll read it for you here. Like, uh, like many projects in the space, questions soon arose about the founder's true intentions and ambitions. The initial excitement quickly turned to skepticism. And I was there in the beginning, by the way. This was when Cliff originally announced that he was working on the Shibnobi blockchain. Um, it, yet one early holder and dedicated community member refused to let Shinobi fade into obscurity. Throughout the bear market, he was haunted by the potential of what could have been. Fast forward 2024, as the crypto market rebounds and the excitement around meme coins grow, he, he believes the time is right for Shibnobi's revival. Beyond financial loss, the disbanding of the Shinja clan, a community of over 10, 70,000, was the hardest blow. Now, with a renewed focus of safety and security, he aims to reunite and rebuild a once strong community. Now, it should be noted here, I'm not going to finish this up, but it should be noted here, 70,000 investors at Shibnobi near the top. Now, uh, this is Asian-themed dog, the ship dog. This is Asian-themed. This is exactly what they like in Asian communities. South Korea, North Korea, North Korea, South Korea, um, uh, Taiwan, Thailand, Hong Kong, China, Shanghai, all of these different places that are, and they're, 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 you know, different, but, uh, the China Chinese market probably opening up Hong Kong already open Shanghai for some reason seems to have be doing a lot too. Um, but you know, the broader broader China is still, we're waiting for them to, to re remove the ban from crypto. And if they do that, when they do that, I should say, uh, when that happens, uh, this thing is going to go absolutely parabolic. I mean, this is exactly what uh, the Asian communities like. Now, in conjunction with that, I should notify you and tell you that uh, they are also, uh, they've opened up oh, over here is the Telegram and that's Shibnobi on base, but inside Shibnobi on base, if you go in there, you'll be able to find the Chinese Shibnobi on base as they try to reach out and get influencers and people from the markets of uh, Asian communities. So if you are excited about uh, cryptocurrency, if you were a fan of Shibnobi or Shinja back in the day, it is my opinion that you'd be doing yourself a disservice if you didn't just grab a little bag just to kind of see what happens here, because I get the feeling that this is a multi-million dollar project currently sitting at a $300,000 market cap. Um, you know, if this thing goes to 30 million, that's not a lot, by the way, 30 million from this point right now, um, my friends, that is a 100X, and we're just going to 30 million. So um, if you want, I'm gonna put the information, it'll be in the description down below. Uh, check out their socials, check out the contract address, buy yourself a little bag, uh, because it's my opinion, that this thing is probably going to go just bonkers at some point pretty soon. So let me know what you think in the comments down below. And remember, none of this is financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor. I'm not qualified to tell you that. And I am paid for promoting this with you. So remember that when you make your decision. Do your own research. Don't just get into something because I'm saying it. That's silly. I'm not a financial advisor. So you do your own research and let me know if what I said is what you agree with. And if so, I'll see you um, uh, I'll see you in Shinja.
It's not financial advice, but I'm always right.